Welcome to Wagtail 3.0. The first thing you're going to notice when you log in are the colors. Colors have been updated and it looks absolutely fantastic. Now a second thing you might notice is that there's a slim sidebar. So if you click this little icon up here, you can see that your menu will change. And when it's in slim mode, you get these nice little tool tips over here. Now when you're editing a page, you're going to see that the page looks quite a bit different from Wagtail 2. Your tabs are all available up here. There's a nice little breadcrumb that it automatically expands for you. All of your options are available in this menu here. So you can move, copy, add child page, and all of your other options are going to be available in there. Your page status is available at any time. You can toggle comments on or off, and you can go straight to your page history. Now there's also another cool feature on here that I want to show you, and it is the stream splitter. So all you have to do is select where you want to split and hit the little scissor icon and it automatically creates a second stream field for you or another rich text block for you based on where you wanted to cut. Now all, all you have to do is create another block in between. And that saves you time from having to copy, paste, delete, and then create a new block. Another really cool feature that comes with Wagtail 3 is image duplication detection. So let's go ahead and change this image and I'm going to upload the exact same image that's already in there. And it's just called duplicate test. So I'm going to go ahead and upload it. And Wagtail is going to say, hey, you already have this image. Do you want to use the new image or do you want to use the existing image and delete the new one? And this helps prevent your website from having too many duplicate images. So I'm going to use the existing one and delete the new one that I just uploaded, preventing my page or my website from having too many duplicate images. Another really cool feature that we're going to not quite see, but it is definitely available now, are permission-based fields. So let's say, me as a super user, as an administrator, I want to be able to change the introduction on this page. But for non-super users, non-administrators, they shouldn't even be able to see this field. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to log out, and I'm going to sign in as a non-administrator. And I'm going to go find that page again. And now that I'm not an administrator, but on that introduction field, I had it set to only super users. So only super users were allowed to edit that field. It no longer shows up for me whatsoever. So now we have field based permissions. So now the last thing I want to show you is page descriptions. And so let's add a child page here. And we can see that you can add a little description down here just to help you understand the context of what the page is supposed to be used for. To see all of the release notes for Wagtail 3, simply go to docs.wagtail.org and click on the release notes.